My balls, dude. dude. My balls have been thanking me because I have been on the every other day uh, schedule schedule for shaving my nuts. Yeah. And it's been, let me tell you, dude, it's been glorious. I know I rave about it all the time in the group chat. Yeah. And I fucking mean it, dude. I literally, I, 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 this sounds very biased, but if somebody gifted me a Manscaped, the lawnmower 4.0 for for Christmas, it would it would be the most used gift I've I would ever use. Yeah, for every other day, every other day, bro. It's fire, dude. Because I I literally just used it earlier. Yeah, and I was like, dude, this is super convenient. Like I was in the shower, like I don't got to clean this shit up. Did you go? You went all the way down. I went all the way down, not on purpose though. It's because I forgot to grab the guard, and I was just mm. like, fuck it, I'm already wet. Were like, you scared to? Go all the way down. A little bit, a little bit. But wow, then, you had no, you didn't have the faith yet. No, I mean, I, I don't, it's, I don't trust myself. You know, got what I mean? you. Yeah, yeah. Because uh, you don't have those surgeon hands. No, I don't. Because I, because I, I don't, I need to wear glasses. You know what I mean? Like I can't really see that well without them. So like I'm in the shower wearing glasses is kind of weird. And I was like, let me just try to do my <laughs> in the best. shower wearing glasses. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that's weird. <laughs> oh, dude, guys, imagine like. <laughs> You're in the shower and with glasses. You can't see shit, dude. Did you just like, imagine me naked? Yeah, 100%. And you're like, it's like you're driving in the rain, but your windshield wipers aren't working. And you're just like, fuck, dude. I'm just going to pray right, right now. Right, dude. It was like splash zone on my face. Yeah. And I'm like, just trying to cut where I could. And right. the end result, it was fire, dude. Like, yeah, so you're you're completely bald right now. At the moment, yeah, I'm com- completely That's bald. kind of fire. We're both sitting next to each other, completely bald. Dude, I think more people need to shave. And well, by more people, more dudes. We, we, well, we wouldn't know how, shave, how shaven people are, though, you know? Yeah, that's true. I wouldn't know, but I feel like it's not talked about enough. Like, maybe. normalize shaving your yeah, nuts. Yeah, okay, maybe we should, maybe people should just stop being homophobic and, like, be open to asking other dudes, like, if they shave down there. Yeah, like, it's super common I like, ask for, like, beard dudes to talk about, like, beard Right, stuff. and what's the difference between the beard up there and the beard down there? Other than there's a fucking big-ass nose <laughs> yeah. down there. Oh, shoot. Also. <laughs> <laughs> it looks the same. Yeah, it's literally the same thing. It's just, like, flipped upside down. Like, if I shave my face pretty regularly, like, why not down there? Like, overall, l- like, aesthetics aside, it just feels more comfortable. Being bald. Yeah. Yeah, it's just, it feels nice. Less itchy. It, it looks nice. Mm-hmm. You know, because every I know every dude can can relate to putting their hands between their legs when they sleep. Like that's a very common man thing to do. Yeah, it's a it's a uh, you put your hands in your pants. Man one hundred and one. Yeah, that's and and that's something that nobody really teaches you. It's sort of just innate. Yeah, it's a uh, that's what humans do. They put their hands in their pants. <laughs> they just put their hands in their pants and they fall asleep. It's just <laughs> comforting, and to like to feel a nice shaven sack or not even sack just pubic area it's yeah. it's comforting to uh, on the on the highest level because like i'm a i'm a boxer brief believer <laughs> thank thank god dude there was a time where you weren't yeah i was like i was just on the you were hating on you were a boxer dude that was hating on boxer briefs like for some reason i just like to feel my shit swing but like it's way better to have them secure in a in a little pocket you that that's why you liked wearing boxers because you like to feel your shit swing no, i mean not literally but like i just felt like this is the this is the way to do it dude right just fucking just you, let your you shit go you didn't like your shit feeling held yeah i before but i think it's, it's because i was comparing it to like like underwear like briefs like super tidy whites. yeah yeah that's uncomfortable yeah very uncomfortable but compared to like boxer briefs and and you just have with no pubes down there, like it's just it's just more comfortable. That's all. Anybody wearing boxers still, you're like, I don't know what the fuck you're doing. You're living in the past. Yeah, I know that was like a like a mid two thousands like man thing of like wearing boxers, but yeah, man it's just shit not is a- dumb, dude. Man shit, exactly. <laughs> man shit is is the ego of the man. It's crazy. That dude. shit's gotta go, man. That's what gets you to drink a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and and I feel like wearing boxers is part of that man shit. Yeah, like you need to get you need to. You need to be you need to be humbled. You need to sit on your nuts or something. Like we need to do something about this man shit that you got going on. Dude, I am a chronic sit on nutter. <laughs> yeah. Maybe it which hasn't I happened don't... before. It doesn't happen as much as before. Right, which I still don't understand how it happens to begin with. Like how the fuck do you sit on your nuts? Dude? Maybe I just got big clackers, dude. <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> but like do you sit recklessly? I, I maybe I just yeah maybe I do like I just sit down. Well, hold on. There's also those type of people too. The people that sit down aggressively. Like you know how like you could like there's two types of people. Like when you sit down, you either sit down 
gently or you sit down aggressively. Yeah. Like there's like people that like you sit like this doing the whole thing. Yeah. Or you just sit gently. Yeah, I feel you. You know what I'm saying? I'm a gentle sitter. What I would, are you? I would think I'm a gentle sitter, but because I sit on my nuts every now and then, I'm you're probably aggressive, aggressive as fuck. Yeah, I should be more mindful. Like, you know when people sit, like, when you're, the only time I could think of where this would be annoying is if you're at a church pew. You know how church pews are, like, they're long, right? Yeah. So if, if somebody sits right next to you and you sit aggressively, they kind of get a, like, the person next to you kind of gets bumped gets up a little lifted. bit. Yeah, they get a little bit lifted. Yeah. So... You got to have some common courtesy and just, you have to learn how to sit gently, you know? Yeah. I, th- I think I sit gentle, dude. Like I, I tuck my chair in and shit. Like, yeah. You know well, that's mean? not sitting. That's the opposite. It's like, <laughs> that's the opposite. Sitting of 101. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, it just, I don't know, man. You, so you've never done it. I'd never sat on my nuts and I, yeah. And I cross my legs and I still don't crush my nuts. And that's another thing too. I was going to say. What's the deal with what's the deal with people hating on crossing your legs? Dude, I see people I see men crossing legs all the time. Like it's not a big deal. What's wrong with this? Why do people have a problem with this? It feels comfy. It's comfy as fuck. Yeah. Like I don't know why it is though. Why is that comfy? Just to have your leg higher. Yeah, I just think it probably reminds you of being a little kid. Being in the womb? Being in the well, you're not a little kid in the womb, but oh. <laughs> like it's it just reminds you of like your body being close to itself yeah like I it guess. like it does feel it, maybe it's like a sitting it's like a sitting fetal position <laughs> yeah <laughs> every time every on my youtube channel somebody sees me sitting like this there's always at least one person like you cross your legs when you sit yeah you fucking beep <laughs> like i guess that used to be a thing where like dudes always got to be like super wide legged and again take up dude all the here space the, i the think thing. the theme of today is fucking man shit you know it's 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 a coincidence that manscape is sponsoring these episodes but man shit that shit's gotta go yeah, dude it's just uh the the male ego is too fragile it just doesn't apply to me man like having to do all that it's like too much work yeah are oh, you saying the by? male the male ego is too much for you to abide like the male rules quote unquote yeah these the, made up rules the, that, the male society that that america's built is too much it's just too much to think about yeah. why don't you just be yourself cross your legs if you're comfortable don't sit on your nuts wear boxer briefs um i think we got be, it all down be you if you want to, if you want to not cross your legs and and wear boxers and do all that shit, that's fine. But don't shame people that do the opposite Dude, of what you exactly. do. Exactly. Don't kink shame me for being comfortable crossing my legs, even though I can't cross it the other way. It can only go one way. <laughs> yeah, it can only work one. Your your uh your stance. Yo, you're I, goofy. Goofy. <laughs> yeah. Like yo, how do you ride a board? Okay, so you probably cross your legs like this. <laughs> yeah. I just never understood. You know what? Those people are probably just jealous because they just they they probably can't cross their legs efficiently. You know just, what? They're not flexible enough to to get it over. That's a good point, dude. They you like you maybe maybe there there's some thick boys out there. Those are probably the same dudes that fucking suck having at, at having sex. Yeah. Like dude. you just your penetration game, your rhythm is off. You just I feel like I'm 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 maybe I'm maybe I'm turning into the same like I'm becoming the same guy. Like uh like hating on the other yeah. side. <laughs> <laughs> when you're one extreme and you go to the other extreme, you're still the same person. Yeah, I'm still the same. Okay, so I apologize. You're not bad at sex. You just don't have a rhythm. That's fine. <laughs> the rhythm. Yeah, it's it's okay if you don't have rhythm. You can learn. You can learn, dude. You know what? You-